Hello and welcome to ExcelDashboardTemplates.com. This is Steve True. Please visit my blog at ExcelDashboardTemplates.com so that you're sure to get the latest Excel tips, tricks, techniques, and everything fun about making Excel charts come alive. All right, uh, today I wanted to show you uh, when you are creating a line chart in Excel, uh, and you can see I've got data over here on the left, and I've got breaks in the data. When you have breaks in the data like this, what ends up happening is Excel's default will be that it will plot it with gaps. So if you create this chart, you'll see the gaps here. Notice some points are even kind of missing because they're not lines yet. They're only single points, so they're just hard to see here on the graph. And I uh, wanted to show you how you can go about and create a connected line chart uh, all the way through. Now be careful, uh, connecting the lines uh, may cause people to think there is an actual connection between January 1st sale and January 4th sale um, and, and that it's a straight linear trend line and it's not. We're just connecting the points to actually make the line show up a little better. So make sure your data is not creating those types of uh, thoughts about the data so uh, you know be careful when using this technique alright well, let's go ahead and get rid of all of these charts and see if we can go ahead and make it for ourselves so what you want to do is highlight your data that has gaps go ahead and create your line chart by going up to the insert ribbon go to the line chart button and then we're just going to do a standard 2D line let's go ahead and move that up here so that we can see it I'm going to get rid, since we only have one line in here, I'm going to get rid of the legend by clicking on it and hitting the delete key. Now, as you can see, we have those gaps uh, showing up and in, in the breaks in the line. So what you want to do to connect those points is click in your chart, go up to your design ribbon. From your design ribbon, you want to hit the select data button in the data group. And then here in the uh, select data source, you want to go to this selection here that says hidden and empty cells. When you click on that you will see a choice that says show empty cells as right now it's gaps. We don't want it to be gaps, zeros. We want to connect data points with a line. So this section is re this selection is really hard to find if you don't know what you're looking for, but go ahead and click on OK. Click on OK again. And look, it's now showing the January 1st data point. It's connecting it to the January 4th and so on. So uh, that's how you can connect your line charts in Excel. Uh, finding that special button, it's under once again the select data button, hidden and empty cells, and then click on connect data points with the line. Okay, uh, thanks for visiting my blog. Make sure you sign up for my YouTube channel so you're sure to get the latest tip and trick. Uh, also there's other great posts on my blog at excel-templates.com. Thank you.